Hi, I'm Eric. Uh, so I grew up in Chengdu, China. My name is Chelsea. I'm from Trinidad and Tobago. My name is Amy. I came to Canada about nine years ago. I'm from Beijing, China. I'm Alistair Magalit. I'm from Hong Kong and I'm also half Filipino. I did my undergrad back in the States in Quinnipiac University in Connecticut and now I'm doing my master's in physical therapy in Western. My first impression is that Western is pretty big. I was a little bit unfamiliar with my surroundings at first but gradually as time goes on I kind of get used to it. I start to have a rhythm and a system of do going things day by day and I actually enjoy it. Well, Western in general I think is a very diverse campus so there's lots of different people from all different backgrounds. The school is definitely bigger. It's also like a really good day choice and stuff and the food options in London is actually not as bad as, as expected. There are good restaurants and um, it's like uh, most doors open next year. I think it's really a good place to live in. Going into a master's program I thought it was more of like a professor that's going to do their talks and we're going to be there to listen and try to absorb that information but coming to here at Western it's more of a discussion so they highly encourage you to uh, voice out your opinions and tell them what you don't understand and try to learn more from them so it's more of a two-way discussion rather than a one-way I really like, as we mentioned, how we have the lectures first, um, the basic knowledge and anatomy, so, and they have the discussion of like, the case-based learning after that. And we're also giving the resources on um, the academic articles that we could look at if we want to like, further enhance our studying. So I think those are really helpful so that we can actually have a resource that we can look at, refer back to the case, and do our own independent research. So I think those knowledge are really helpful for the case study. I didn't expect it to be as intense as it was. <laughs> I think everything that we're learning, like we will use it. We have to apply it every time we go into lab and every time we go into our case discussions. We always have to pull on knowledge that we have from since they start in September. But I think it's an amazing program and our professors are always there to discuss with us and like if we wanted to meet after to talk with them. Um, if we didn't understand anything, they're always there to help us with that too. My application process was as smooth as I wanted to be, <laughs> uh, which is my fault because I actually missed the deadline for uh, Western and some other schools. And I ended up calling all of the admission officers of each school. And it was Donna who picked up the phone and told me that uh, oh, the Western, they're going to review the international application one week after the deadline. Mm -hmm. So she told me to not worry about it. And I think Western has provided me with enough support. I liked the interview aspect of it because I kind of got a feel for what the professors were like. I would just say start early. Um, make sure you have all your documents together. I think the most challenging part for me was probably writing the like essay that we had to do. So yeah, just organize your thoughts. And then in the interview process, like just be yourself. Uh, Western has really good international um, support services. The, the staff there were just super nice and they answered my questions perfectly. And yeah, that really helped. When we got here and we started, like, I liked that they had like gatherings where we could meet other international students in the program and then other programs as well. Because it really does help you find a family. <laughs> I think it's really important for you to appreciate the role of physiotherapy in the healthcare system, knowing that being active, it is good. And for injuries, it's not just like, oh, you do a surgery and you're good to go. And appreciate the benefits of exercising. I think once you're interested in helping people, so like we're in a profession where we really spend a lot of time just thinking about how to help people in general as like a whole person. I feel like sometimes a lot of people think, oh, like you go into physiotherapy and it's about like sports and lifting and stuff like that. But it's really about looking as, at people as like a whole person, their whole life, their background. You have to be a caring person. 